Good morning, everybody. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Here we are uh, with CSM Live. My name is Jackie, and we are live at Kathy Allen's house in Stony Plain, Alberta. There's <laughs> Kathy. There's Kim. Connie. I guess we're doing the wave. And <laughs> Carrie. <laughs> So today we are going to, uh, we're actually working outside, it's not that, uh, it's not that, I wouldn't say it's warm, it's kind of chilly, uh, but out here we are die-hard scrapbookers in the yard, uh, going to play with some Stabilos, Carriers, so we'll get right down to it, flip your Okay. Okay, Carrie, show us what you are going to make. Um, Circles. Circles. Do you ever have one of those days where you feel like you're just going in circles? So, oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is my meditation after one of those days. Uh, okay, all over Pinterest, beautiful. have you seen a lot of circle art? In anyway, sort I have. of these so, bubblies, yeah. Yeah, and I just thought, how do you do that? So we tried with some stabilos, and it works really well. Okay, cool. So I've kind of staged it out here because it takes a bit of time to dry between. I um for this card. For the background, I took our CSM cardstock okay. and then used the Ranger um, collage medium to right. just. This is an old book. I bought it in old store, and I collage medium it on, and then I put some clear gesso on top, okay. just so that the woodies go Perfect. a little smoother. There's yeah. a, some people just popped on that are new, okay. so I'll just tell them what we're doing. Carrie Ingle is here, and she's going to be working with some Stabilo markers or pencils, I should say, woody pencils. Oh, yes. Right there. Look at those. Those are cool. Fun. Nice and stubby. They're nice and stubby. And she's going to create this card for us. So keep going there, Carrie. Okay, sure. So it's a circle, and so you can't really do it wrong. So, you know, I just kind of started off, and you just color and make your circles. And you do them wherever just you want. Just randomly. Yeah. And Carrie, how does it, how does that pencil crayon feel? Does it feel? It's very um, buttery. Buttery. It's buttery. Okay. And I found, um, I wanted the gesso on top just to make it go a little smoother. Oh, so, you know, so to spread it a bit. Yeah. Okay. So once you um, add you've the got, water. You clear gesso on top of this uh, old piece of paper. That's right. right. And okay. when you go to add the water to activate, um, the watercolor crayon, you kind of want it to smooth and okay. bleed and blend. It. So it's it's a uh, pretty simple. So you kind of just do all your circles, um, whatever you want them. We'll just do circles while we're waiting for people. We'll yes. Color some circles. So there is Carrie uh, working with the Stabilo Woody three in ones. Yeah, Very so cool. you know you can. I just love how they look. Yeah, people will. Uh, you have them stored in this cute little container here yeah. too. Just a normal. Is that just a normal pencil sharpener? Uh, no, this comes with. The, oh, that actually comes, that comes with, with it. it. Okay, because yeah, you're gonna. Want oh yeah, I guess. That. So, and they come in nice some great thing. colors. Maybe like really cool. beautiful colors. This one's my favorite. Okay. I see that. Yeah, you use it quite I a bit use here. it quite a bit. So I kind of uh, color over my circles a bit, and then um, I got lots of water because. She's outside. The Carrie keeps her water in the cutest little container. Yeah, those are our little yogurt containers. To so um, recycled yogurt containers. Yeah. Okay. So uh, just starting, you know, with your lighter color, and it just it's just making circles, right? Just having fun, Neat. and you activate it, and it and just it spreads really nice. So for those of you who are just nice. joining us, this is where we're going. I'm just gonna while you're doing that, Carrie, you can keep going. Yeah, we're just gonna layer a bunch of Stabilo products, right? Yeah. So um, I just did circle see and I colored over Let's see if we can get one more green out of this and um, go over here, over here. wow that spreads really nice yeah just and I like how they blend together yeah. and then we'll move over to a darker one on top Nice. And you just let your circles dry. So okay. it's pretty simple. So magic, magic of, 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 of being of, ready. So then, um, because <laughs> we're live, ta-da! We it's it. dry. It's dry. Yay! It's dry. So um, next step was to use their um, pen sixty-eight. Okay. So these have a felt tip. Okay. And I discovered they're they're uh, they activate with water. Oh, so, and so, so do you have to make sure it's dry before you use yes, it? Yes, okay. yeah. So, and so if you see on here, I was just trying to create some dimension, right? Right. And so Definitely I'm looks, just learning yeah. dimension. Oh, no, that looks beautiful. Okay. So, um, you know, it was just 
And this isn't um, accurate, right? Right. And I find um, See, they, I, they, I, 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 that's neat. It's not. Um, it's just fussy, and I do find they get a little gummy on on top of the uh, watercolor, right? Okay. So I just would wear them, rub them off on a clean piece of paper. So we're doing this because then we're going to activate this. Okay. And it's going to. Um, we're going to run out of that one. Okay. And it's going to um, make like a border, right? So we start with that, and then. So for those of you who are just joining, as Carrie is outlining those, this is where we are going. Carrie is showing you how to do this, which is absolutely stunning, and it's, it's a neat process using the Stabilo 3-in-1 yeah. woody pens, and now the 30 pen set, pen 68 set. Okay, so see, I'm just outlining. Oh, I got a little gummed up. So then we outline. And so what you can do just to keep this moving. Then we would just take the water and I just I just drew over this, right? So then you're sort of getting your edge on your circle, right? Okay. Right? And it's it's just all very organic, right? And when it dries, you know, it kind of bleeds out a bit. Right. And gets fun. And you know, I oh, we would have needed to do a yellow one there, okay. but we'll leave this one. Sure. So we'll move along. Now, but you can kind of see you're just definitely. slowly adding slowly it's layers. Growing. So then what we do is now it's dry. I have to look at my instructions. There. Then I took the black one. Okay. And with the black one, I kind of I got a little mess here. And then went in there. You can see I'm um. Not being accurate, right? Oh, well, that's the best kind. Yeah, of, that's, that's the best, the best kind of art. Yeah, <laughs> right. And uh, so then, you know, you're going Christine here. Christine Davison said that looks fabulous and fun. Karen. It's very fun. Yeah. So what I'm going to do? Do you want me to move on? And yeah. Add? Okay. Sure, so we get, here we, get what we, we got there. we got what in. So here we are. And, this, the, and you didn't wet this. No, okay. not yet. Okay, but perfect. so there were two different ways to do it. Like on this one, you can kind of see. It's a little sharper, right? Right, but I do kind of like the look of when I we do activate the black kind of in between. Okay. Right, and it kind of oh, it makes it gives it sort of a shadow outline. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, I like right? that too. And so I shadow it, and um, and then once you kind of do that, I'll just do this one real quick. Cool. So you see, it's just bleeding. It's popping. Yeah. It's just popping, right? And so right. your circles kind of come to life. And then what I did was we move over to this set of we just we're just we're just a, a stabello timing. <laughs> These are really fun, and I, I I've uh, these are the chalk pastels. Yeah, yes. there, there. Oh, do you want me to open it? Well, you can you can Spare. open it if you like, there and we go. you can take ooh yum yeah. yum yum yum. It's pretty yummy in there. So okay, you have those. And so then once again, like you know, I'm I'm, I'm not an artist, but it oh, makes scary. you feel like one, right? So you can just uh, go in and, and shade, right? So then I was just shading, and you can you know uh, slowly add some dimension to this, and take the green, and it just you're just slowly building it up like over time, right? And it just. And as you go, can you see it kind of just yes, kind of comes to life? It's slowly coming to life. It yeah. looks really cool. Yeah. And you know what, Carrie? You make it look so easy. It is pretty easy. Hey? And I just, I just kind of chose. And I think the the beauty here is that they're all corresponding, right? The, right. The colors and or yeah. the or the, or the all the sets, the, right? The, sets, right? the right. you know the woodies with this. Like you can kind of just keep right. choosing um, colors that that work with what you laid down first, right? Cool. So, um, now what are you gonna Now do? I gotta show you something really fun with these woodies. Okay. Where is it? So, there's the white. Now you'll see on here I kinda got some, um, black splatters and some white splatters. Right. We don't have it out here, but, um, it's really quite magical. When I was doing this with my heat tool, right. when the paper was heated and I'd rubbed the white on, right. it would kinda just melt. Oh, right, it okay. would melt on, but so you know, we're going to add our little 
dots here, you know, are the light reflections. We're going to add those and see so how it slowly it's, it's beautiful. It's coming to life. It's really beautiful. But this is the fun thing with these. Um, you can flicker your... Oh, wow. That's cool. You're flicking. Right off the oh, brush, wow. right? And so we're getting Kathy's table all dirty. That's but, nice. um, you know, so I know she's very tidy, this lady, so <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to mess up her um, For those of you who are just right? joining us, uh, Kelly or Carrie is just working away here, creating a beautiful project and using then, this a whole bunch of different Stabilo products. Yeah. And, and this one's really cute. Nifty add in using those some woodies. water, right? Yeah. Some white to... Uh, to edge it like I did on where's the original here it is yeah so on the original right so I, I added some white right and um, then I edged it with the okay. black at the end nice and um, to make it all shiny I added some varnish oh yeah that's what the shiny finish is. and so then that's just kind of popped it to life right and Very then nice. I just um, took you know a sentiment laid it on top but I, I wanted to show you a few things like when I was practicing I was making backgrounds and then I was like, oh, I didn't like them. I wasn't happy. So then I just ran them through the die cut machine. Oh, yes. Very and aren't smart. these beautiful with, yes. um, with, you know, the stabilos on, yeah. the, on the old paper? And yeah. Is this already varnished? No, this is a That's varnished. That's not varnished. No, that's just so ran just, through. Yeah, ran right. through the die cut. So those are cool. the ranger die cuts. And you have another project there. That well, this is it? the same same idea, but on white paper. On white paper. Right. So you can, you can see all the... You know when you start coloring in with the black right and um, the pens actually probably run smoother on uh, when you're outlining right than on this old textured paper but so uh, Christine's just asked oh my goodness mm -hmm. what type of crayon is that so if you want to just show her again sure. it's the Stabilo and they're a woody uh, three in one so you can um, color straight away with them you can activate them with water or you can rub them with your fingers that is so mm -hmm. nifty carry mm -hmm. So you this know, one's coming along. What I would love you guys room. to do is to leave us a comment, uh, tell us where you're from, and then we'll get back to you. And uh, we'd love to see who was watching from where. Thank you, Carrie. Welcome. That is cool. I love all of these products on this table. We're outside, and you can hear somebody whipper snipping behind <laughs> us, which is really what scrapbooking is all about. And I'm going to show you these lovely ladies over here. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. <laughs> All right, everybody, thanks for watching. Uh, until next time, take care. Bye. Bye. <laughs>